We're it's, having a great day out here at, Kim, at Kemper Lakes. Um, when, when it comes to the, the diversity debate, I don't, I don't want to say it's a debate, but, but there is one in terms of, uh, of how you do it. Um, in a very practical uh, sense, what, what are you working on and how are you doing it? Well, listen, I think, Andrew, the, the, it, it's really, when you think about, it's so surprising in this day and age that when you look at S&P 500 CEOs and we only have 5% are women, that we have some work to do. And this summit is really all about, you know, getting more women into the C-suite. So we asked CEOs, this is the fourth year in a row, to um, invite two of their up and coming women to be part of this leadership development program. And they get to hear from amazing speakers. They get to interact with people in business and have a year long programming. And we have um, amazing speakers like Condoleezza Rice. Uh, this year we have former four star general um, Admiral from the from the Navy, Michelle Howard, and um, they just get inspired about kind of going for it within their careers. And we get to do that here as part of the, the championship, the Women's PGA Championship, and also try to elevate the game of golf for women on the LPGA Tour as well. Hey, Lynn, if you're on the board of a Fortune 500 company today uh, and you're going through the interview process or the recruitment process of a CEO, and diversity is part of, well, A, should diversity be part of the mandate? Let's, let, let's even start the question there. Well, I think diversity absolutely needs to be part of the mandate. When you think about what organizations are facing in the marketplace of change, um, it requires you know, different perspectives um, in the boardroom as well as in the C-suite. I think the opportunity to collaborate in new ways uh, we're moving at break speed, and if you have a, a management team uh, that all has a very similar background, that all look the same, I think you're missing the boat. Um, Lynn, what's the, what's the one biggest challenge that you, you hear from, from, from CEOs, from board members on this issue? Well, you know, I think what we hear is they're saying the pipeline is not there, and I think that that is, is just wrong. I think we have women who have the experience um, who have, have really uh, been in positions uh, that prepare them well. And we, we talked to women too, and we did a recent study where they desire for these roles. And I think that if, if you're not seeing women on the slates, uh, you need to push back and ask again, because they're there. Uh, we see them, we have 200 of those women right here at our summit today. And I think that there's a huge opportunity to uh, really push the envelope and, and, and insist on having more women on the slate. Okay, Lynn, thank you for joining us this morning. Good luck with it today. Thank you, Andrew. Appreciate it. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.